Howdy folks of the Sidemen Reacts channel. I'm here with Mini Minter and KSI. We are watching crazy laws that still exist around the world. It's getting banged up. Free my guys. Free my hitters. Free up any injustice. It's just start the video. Just start the video. <laughs> you think about taking a bath with a donkey? Fancy getting drunk donkey. in a British pub? <laughs> these potentially harmless activities and many more could well land you in trouble with the long arm of the law. Laws of the land that may have made sense when first brought about have a habit of sticking around even if they have no real place in today's society. Add to those antiquated laws a few newer bizarre rules of the land that have found their way into the law books, and we have a truly bizarre set of world legislation. So oh. what are some of the strangest laws that still remain on the books around the world? Oh. That's what we'll find out. In We're gonna learn something today. Yeah. We're gonna Strange learn something. laws that still exist. Great Britain Yay. has some of the strangest laws in the world, some of which are broken every day. It is illegal, for example, to be drunk in a pub in the UK. Wait, well, um, me and Harry are fucked. <laughs> well, I think everyone. I think everyone's fucked. fucked. Yeah, everyone's fucked. Yeah, what? Like, what? Oh, I'm bro, ready to hear this though. We, what the bro, fuck? we literally have a video of us being drunk in pubs. Yeah, but it's legal, bro. Apparently. How many thousands of Brits break that law every single day? It is also illegal to carry a plank of wood along the <laughs> pavement, especially one would imagine after getting what? drunk in the pub. Not quite so bizarre you can't, is the stipulation. You can't, you can't, you can't a plank of wood down the street. It's illegal. Are we sure that this isn't some American Donny that's just heard, you know? Do you reckon like, he's he, just Googled shit? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so Googled shit. So then every time I've walked across a pavement, I it's been illegal. No, have you got a plank of wood on you all the time? Yeah, have you held a plank of wood all the time? I'm talking about my penis. It's uh. a plank. Your, your penis is a plank. Your penis is a plank, bro. Uh, I feel uh, bro, so sorry I for your I did it for the, I did I it for the so joke. So you yeah, it did land, bro. It stunk. Know, it, it it stunk, bro. Died. Right, listen, old KSI will thinking. never be topped, bro. Oh, I'm saying, fuck yeah. you, bro. This one's dry, bro. He's got <laughs> blank cock. <laughs> getting drunk in the pub. Not quite so bizarre is the stipulation that members of parliament in jolly old England are not allowed to wear a suit of armor in parliament. But surely this law should have what? been updated by the lawmakers themselves what? while in parliament, no? It is also highly illegal to handle a salmon in suspicious circumstances in England and Wales. What's and this? What's this? Wait. Just, what the what's fuck this? Wait, mean? finish this, finish this. Oh my god, suspicious. There is an unsuspicious way to handle freshwater fish out of water. We'd love to see it. How do you Who it? decides if it's suspicious or not? <laughs> <laughs> is there like a committee watching every salmon? What the fuck? It's also an offense to beat or shake a carpet or rug, except if it's a doormat before 8 a.m. in the UK. And if you're an Englander, forget Lads. about dining on exotic waterfowl. Unless you happen to be the Queen of England, it is illegal I knew to that eat one. a swan. Should you I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, I, didn't no, know that. I think you actually can't do that. Should you be pregnant in Britain, it is perfectly legal to spend a penny in a policeman's hat, or in fact, anywhere else should it be an emergency. And on a similar note, and what? on the subject of toilets, up in Scotland, if somebody knocks on your door asking to use the bog, you must, by law, let them inside and offer your bathroom. Also, did <laughs> 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 you hear the way he said bog? If someone comes and knocks on your door and asks you to use your bog? <laughs> if that's real, bro, I'd be going around knocking on everyone's door. Oh 100, God, bro. Yeah. bro. There's been so many times when I nearly pissed myself, bro. Oh, no, I'd do it just to just so my toilet's clean. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just where are you going, Simon? Uh, just nipping out for a trick. Wait, <laughs> so if you knew where someone famous lived, you could go knock on their door and they have to legally let you bro, in. Bro, the Simon house would be a wreck. Oh, the Can Simon I use your... Don't say it! Don't say it! <laughs> yeah, no, bro, bro, bro. We, we just wouldn't live in Scotland. Also in Scotland, that bizarrely colourful land of haggis and bagpipes, there may be more to that folktale about Scotsmen and their kilts. Ever wondered what exactly is beneath the famous tartan kilt? Cut. <laughs> okay, okay, then. Alright. You put it is. I'm not wrong. Uh, a plank well, of wood. A plank of wood, bro. Actually, yeah, a plank of wood, bro. Well, according to ancient legend, nothing. No underwear can be worn under the kilt. So and according to an really? old law, or perhaps, to be fair, urban legend, uh. if a Scotsman is found to be wearing underwear beneath his kilt, then he is routinely charged two beers by whoever discovered his non Oh, wow, that's status. what. That's, that's what, quite So you cool. don't even get fined money, you get fined beers. I might go so if I go around just lifting up people's kilts, <laughs> Yeah, and I'm like, oh, okay, that's a cock. That's a cock. Yeah, that's a cock. <laughs> oh, there's some pants. You owe me some beers. That's a, that's a probably a sick drinking game right there. That's <laughs> sexual assault. <laughs> <laughs> well, so you 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 break a law to break another law. Yeah, I'm I'm literally like manhandling three cocks just to get two beers. <laughs> 
<laughs> do what right. you gotta do, man. This is, this is going, yeah. <laughs> do it's what just, you gotta do. It's just going south now, isn't it? <laughs> Although we can't confirm the exact legal standing of this law, it is too difficult to resist sharing. The USA also has its fair share of donkey go. laws. In Arizona, donkey bath. allowing your pet donkey to sleep in the bathtub is against the law. Oh, Placing bro. salt on what? a railway track is an offense punishable by the death penalty in Birmingham. What? As death, death penalty. For putting salt on the fucking train track. Imagine. Dying. Do you know what? I like how we've gone to America and and two laws in, we're into the death penalty. <laughs> 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 Just two, it took two laws, bro. That one's two. like, you get fined two pints. Oh, if you put salt on the train, you're dead, lad. You're dead, you, you die. <laughs> yeah, that's it. At first glance, this seems a tad harsh. But the reason is that the train could either derail or attract cattle onto the track, which okay, could also fair. result in a major uh, derailment. Should have led with that. Delay. Yeah, so that, that yeah. should have been. Yeah, it should have been said earlier, yeah. lad. Yeah, exactly. Hey. It's also against the law to play a game of frisbee without first acquiring the permission of a lifeguard in Los Angeles. Although responsible really? frisbee throwing is, we are told, permitted. Who can blame the city with all those lawsuits flying around? And what mm. happened to the chicken who crossed the road in Georgia? Its owner got arrested. It is against the law to let your chickens roam around unattended in this state. In Hawaii, <laughs> wow. it is illegal to work at the same company as your twin brother or sister. We guess what? this law is in place to avoid workplace confusion as to who is doing what and who has taken the day off. And dog lovers, <laughs> beware. Unless you have four legs and a tail that wags, it's illegal to live in a dog kennel in Idaho, bringing a whole new meaning to sleeping in the doghouse. Perhaps stranger than all these laws, though, is the law in Vermont, whereby women who want false teeth are required by law to first obtain permission from their husband. Quite why this what? law still exists oh is totally baffling what? to us here at the Infographic Show. Perhaps oh. someone can explain this I'm one. Finished, hey, it's Josh. Bro. It's Josh. <laughs> Josh. That is Josh. mad, you know. Imagine Freya. Freya's there, uh, just <laughs> 80 years old, having to <laughs> beg Josh. <laughs> Please, right. let me get fake teeth. <laughs> well, she'll be, she be like, oh, babe, I'm in a fake game. <laughs> Why this law still exists is totally baffling to us here at the Infographic Show. Perhaps someone can explain this one to us. And then there's the strange legal world of mainland Europe. In Greece, it is here illegal go. to go sightseeing around the ancient ruins wearing high heels. And in France, it is what? illegal to name your pet pig Napoleon. In Rome, oh Italy, God. keeping a lone goldfish in a fishbowl is considered animal cruelty and is against the law. <laughs> but if you have more than one in the bowl, that is considered acceptable because we all know fish are sociable creatures. Well, you put like 200 in a very small bowl. I mean, well, yeah, that again is No, probably, that's fine. Yeah. That's fine legally. It's, yeah. um, I mean, it's, there's probably... Uh, they'll die. Oh, Kids in parts of Poland are not allowed to travel outside the house with any Winnie the Pooh memorabilia, including t-shirts, backpacks, or lunch boxes. Oh the cartoon God. character is considered a non-gender specific inappropriate hermaphrodite without having the decency to wear a pair of pants, and the Poles, for some reason, find Winnie's lack of genitalia offensive. I don't, I don't know how to react to this one. I, I reckon Lewandowski could leave the house in it. <coughs> yeah, yeah, mate. They're not gonna get rid of him. He's yeah, the yeah, best yeah, thing yeah. to come out of Poland, right? <laughs> <laughs> This one isn't exactly an ancient law, but was simply too brilliant to leave out of our study of quirky laws. In the Cambodian capital of Phnom oh. Penh, the sale and importation of water pistols is prohibited during New Year festivities. The reason being that a popular way to enjoy the New Year in this part of the world is to take part in a huge water fight. And that, Governor Che Sofara reckons, may lead to social unrest. In Thailand, right. it is illegal okay. to step on money, and it is also <laughs> illegal to leave- Wait, <laughs> Someone's just dropped like a little fucking tenner. By accident, they just step on it, bro. Sentenced yeah. to death. In parts of India, if a man is in debt, he can legally offer his wife as a down payment until oh the debt God. is settled. Oh. In Japan, <laughs> my Chris, you literally don't pay your debt off on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I owe you five. There you go. A fiver. Fuck's sake. In Japan, it is illegal to be fat, with the government setting a maximum <laughs> waistline of 33 and a half inches for men, oh, 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 and JJ and half fuck. inches for women. Oh, no, 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 no. Me and JJ are fucked. Oh, yeah, shut up, no, man. Do you know what, lads? Actually, I found this out the other day. I've got 28 inch waist now. I think I'm a 34 inch waist. <laughs> oh, mate, you're done. Well, I'm 36. Yeah, but do you know what it is, so... though, bro? You're like. Well, I, I guess that makes sense. You hardly ever see any fat people in Japan. Imagine if that law is in England. Bro, it won't be people about. <laughs> 
<laughs> we ain't about no more, bro. In China, Buddhist monks are banned from reincarnating unless they have specific government permission. <laughs> sorry, Asia sorry. No sorry, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> wait. It just said <laughs> it's banned from reincarnating without the government's permission. I'm finished. <laughs> I right, do you know what? Maybe I should laugh because this is like certain people's like no, no, like you're just, to wear, no, but you, if you, you believe in reincarnation, but, that's oh, fair. Man. But to ask the government uh, for permission, but, uh, why just go like, <laughs> ah, right, you can come back as a frog. Bro, <laughs> do you know what? You you didn't do much for us, so you can be a fucking toad, bro. You can be a fucking toad. Uh, I imagine uh, the guy, the government's just like, nah. <laughs> exactly. Bro, the has don't, don't been a Buddhist his whole life. He's, he's, uh, whatever, whatever they are, monks. Oh, I don't even know what the fuck they are. I've had it. I've had it. I've had it. In Samoa, it is oh. illegal to forget your wife's birthday. In oh Australia, God. it is against the law to disrupt a wedding, an act that is punishable by a fine of ten thousand dollars. All in all, across the world, does Australia not say like? Does anyone have any objections? I, I guess not. Like once the, once the ceremony starts, Does disrupting fucked. a wedding mean like, so say if I don't realize that venue's actually got a wedding that day and I stroll in. That's disrupting, bro. That disrupted it, yeah. 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 There's, what if you sneeze? I mean, wedding crashes just wouldn't happen in Australia. Maybe yeah. they don't even have that movie over there. I was gonna say, it'd be a different film. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, humans fuck this planet, bro. Beforehand it was just, what, a couple cows, a couple horses, moving. All of that. Now look, you gotta ask me if you can have teeth. It's a wreck. It's a wreck. Mom, you got asked to be reincarnated. <laughs> I, you got, I, imagine asking Boris if you could be reincarnated. Bro. <laughs> yeah, Boris, <laughs> reckon I can come back, bro. <laughs> I want my gula, can I come back to you? <laughs> oh, I'm done. Hey, yo, thank you for watching. Uh, be sure to subscribe, please.